we're asked to differentiate this, this particular function, so solution. So the first thing we want to do is rewrite this. You see this 2x here that's being cubed. That could be a mess, um, so let's rewrite this. So f of x equals, now keep in mind, 2x quantity cubed can be written as 2 cubed x cubed, which is 8 x cubed. So let's write this as 3 over 8 x cubed plus 3 sine 6x minus 10. All right, almost where we want to be. Um, this, this piece here is still a bit of a pain. So what we'll do is we'll bring the x cubed upstairs to make it easier to differentiate. So we have 3 eighths x to the negative 3. Really nice technique. Plus 3 sine 6x minus 10. All right, now we're ready to differentiate. Here we'll use the power rule, so p rule. Here we have to use the chain rule. Chain rule. Why? Because it's not just sine x, it's sine of 6x. All right, so let's finish. So the derivative of f. So for this first derivative, we'll just bring the negative 3 down. So we get negative 3 times 3 is negative 9 over 8 x to the negative 4, because negative 3 minus 1 is negative 4, plus 3 times the derivative of sine is cosine, so it'll be cosine 6x, don't touch the inside, it's the chain rule, times the derivative of the inside, the derivative of 6x is 6, minus 0, the derivative of 10 is 0. So to finish, let's just clean this up, so this is negative 9 over 8 x to the 4th, uh, 6 times 3 is 18, so 18 cosine 6x. That's it, just a really quick video on how to find a derivative. This one was a little bit harder.